So what does a, a mushroom have to do with a habitat on Mars? Well, it turns out, just like these hyphae grow through the soil on the Earth, they're more than happy to grow to fill a mold, a mold filling a mold, if you know what I mean, and build some kind of structure. Now, you may think that's kind of silly, because who would want something that's made of mushrooms? A house made of mushrooms? That sounds a little squishy. Well, there are all sorts of ways that you can treat these things. You can grow them around sand with some nutrients, for example. You can grow them around wood chips. You can bake them and make them hard. On the left, you can see this gentleman trying to break concrete bricks. And on the right, you can see him trying to break one that made out of our fungal mycelia. It gets better. So I believe the constraints really force you to be creative. And once you're creative, that's when you can start having the game-changing solutions. And so once we start to look at this sort of technology for off-planet with that breathing room of the fact that we have no choice and therefore it's got to work, we're not worrying about this quarter's investment, we're worrying about it's got to work long term, we now have game-changing solutions that I really believe will revolutionize both life on planet Earth and life past the Earth.